Hey guys, so today's video is a hair salon vlog. I almost forgot to film an intro. I'm actually parked in my car right now on the side of the road. So I'm gonna take you along with me into the hair salon. I actually have anxiety about this because I hate filming in front of people. I just, I just hate it. I won't even film around my husband. So this is a really big deal for me. So please be kind. If you think I look awkward, it's because I am. So here's my hair before. You can't really see it. So I'm going to ask my hairstylist to kind of show a good like video of my hair before. And then we will compare to how it looks after. I have a few ideas of what I want. So I'm going to show her some pictures, see what she thinks. And yeah, I'm probably going to stick to the same hair color. Just, you know, do the same thing we've always done. Just touch up the roots and whatnot. But yeah, I'll have her explain what she does and let's go ahead and get started. Is that what you would call like long layers? Yeah, okay. yeah. So you want to see some more like, just kind of like some more texture. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah okay. Cool. And then the hair color, I think what we normally do. Yeah, we just need to like bring your blonde up again. Yeah. So we don't see any of that grassiness. Okay. And then, yeah, right then. Yay. Yay. I watched it two days ago. <laughs> I feel like it's always so dirty when I see you. <laughs> So we're starting out first by trimming, cutting my hair. So we're doing the layers. Usually I ask for just like a small trim um, and I get it cut like even all the way at the bottom. But I wanted to do something a little bit different this time. My ends were looking a little bit straggly and I just wanted more texture. So the picture that you saw in the beginning, that's kind of what we're trying to mimic here. And here's the first round of coloring. <laughs> okay, Mackenzie's going to explain what she does to my hair. She wears the side part, but I always like to make sure that the hair can um, be parted in any way. So I start in the back, but I still like to start with my sections nice and clean. So I do, I do part her hair where she does. And I have to do a voiceover because of the music in the background, but she's talking about how she does the air touch technique, which she will show you. So she's saying she does a combination of highlights and also balayage. And she does that combination in order to create the best blend. And she does this technique so that I'm able to go three months in between my appointments. Which I do. <laughs> so then once I'm done with all of my highlights, I'll go in and do a little bit of a root smudge just so that it helps blend everything out and help it grow seamlessly um, so that she can make it to the next appointment. And then a gloss. And here I am showing you just how grown out my hair has gotten within the last three and a half months since I've seen Mackenzie. Um, you can see how gross it looks. <laughs> this is the part where uh, the it takes it blows out all of the like new growth, all the baby hairs. Plus, this is going to create like natural dimension. So you've got basically a natural low light. Plus, whenever I pull it apart, it kind of creates almost like a tease effect. And then this is the part that I highlight. And I use a little bit of conditioner at the root just for a blending agent. And then I'll go in with my lightener, paint it on all the, um, the hair that's not already lightened, feather it up real good so that it's nice and blended. Pop out the already lightened hair. And there's my, there's my highlight. So we'll do that. <laughs> and here's what my hair looked like with foils after the first bowl of color was finished. Round two. Round two. 
and Mackenzie and I thought it would be fun to guess how many foils were in my head. So when all was said and done, I guessed 105, she guessed 150, I think, and it ended up being 103 foils that we had taken out. I would say the average time that it takes for me to get my hair done is about four hours. Last ball. Round three. And then this is what my head looks like when 103 foils are in it. <laughs> and now it's time to sit under the heat lamp and let my hair process. And then we are going to rinse it. <laughs> and now here she is just lightening my ends because um, we want them to pop a little bit. And then she takes this mustard looking sauce and she applies it to my roots and she does a root smudge. So this really helps with the grow out of my roots and that is how I'm able to go three months in between. And I had to turn the massage chair on. Now we are rinsing the gloss that she put on my hair. Um, and now we are doing my least favorite part. You can ask Mackenzie, I have like the tangliest hair when it's wet and the blow drying, it just takes forever. I have fine hair, but I have a lot of it. So it takes a while to blow dry. So that is it you guys, that is my salon vlog. I'll be sure to include all the details in my item description. Um, so be sure to check that out. Check that out for McKinsey's information too. If you're in Pensacola, near Pensacola, you have to go to her. She is seriously the best. And I can't thank her enough for letting me take the time to film her and film the process. Thank you, McKinsey. You're the best. I love you. So thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, leave a comment, and I will see you guys in my next one. Mwah! Bye.